Hello everyone, this is George's Aquascape, and today I'm going to make in part two of making a vivarium. Uh, what we're going to be doing is we're going to be adding the substrate, the soil, the plants, and other pieces of decoration. I'm sorry for any background noise because my brother and mum are at home, and I am fi uh, filming this in my bedroom, as you can see. We finished the clay background, and I think it looks very nice for the setting that I want it to be. I want it to be a woodland setting, and that's to suit the uh, amphibians that will be going in here, which are newts. First we're going to add our rocks, you usually use something like hydro balls as the um, bottom layer so the water can drain through and not dampen and destroy the soil. You do want the soil to be slightly damp, especially for amphibians like dart frogs and other amphibians, but you don't want it to be soaked because then it will degrade quicker. So I'm just going to add all these rocks. Uh, sorry for what I'm wearing, I'm actually wearing my pyjamas because I was ready to go to bed. But I thought, nope, I'm going to quickly film a video first. It is in fact my birthday tomorrow, so hopefully I will be getting some new, uh, new equipment gear, if I'm lucky. And maybe a new tank as well, which I will film and make a video for you guys. What I'm doing now is I'm placing the largest rocks at the bottom. You can get these anywhere, I just got them from my garden because we have one of those little pebble runways in my driveway. Runway isn't probably the right term to use, but that's what it looks like. and some smaller pebbles to fill up the space. Now what I'm going to use is to block the uh, dirt and the, uh, sorry, the soil and the um, rocks is I'm going to use one of these and the best thing to use is something like this which has loads of little holes in it but unfortunately I don't have a big piece of this so I'm going to have to use this. This does degrade over time but it degrades slowly and it keeps a thin layer just over the uh, rocks which will stop any of the soil getting into it. As my last one was still there when I um, decided to redo this tank and that was... I'd done it originally quite, quite a very long time ago. Now what we're going to use is a plastic cup and some soil I already have down underneath the desk. I'm going to scoop it up and I'm going to place it on top. Uh, I also have some plants prepared which are in the soil so I'm going to quickly take them out there. Sorry about knocking the tripod. I wasn't very prepared to make this video.
Right, now I'm going to add the decorative pieces. As I've, I've already added quite a few pieces to it, it's starting to come along quite nicely. Sorry about that, I don't need to get in the way. Another thing I like to do is uh, I have a nice pile of mosses here and I also have the newts. I don't know how well you can see that. But I'll be putting them in a bit, I'm just going to add a couple of these mosses. I'm not going to add these. 